Yes, guys, this is it here. Cream mashed potato, garlic, grilled garlic potatoes, roast fish, pineapple, mushroom, tomato, everything in it. Stay tuned, guys, for the full recipe. edition of Trini Out and About. Today edition we are doing, we are doing something, we are going on the healthy side today, right, a little bit on the healthy side after all that oil and frying and all these things. We are going and do a roast fish with some garlic potatoes and cream mashed potatoes. We are going to show you two different types of potatoes you can do, right guys? So step by step, you know we just do it, step by step ingredient, everything start to finish. All ingredients, right? We have Anusha, the main attraction, right? <laughs> Tell them hi. Hey, bless you, know <laughs> right? So, you know, we do it step by step. All ingredients, right? All ingredients. Mommy. Every Everything we do it. Right, guys? So, stay tuned. Oh, no, We're going to start with all the, with the fish and the potatoes and things, and we'll get back to you guys. Stay tuned. Let me go on. Knock our pot. Right guys, we back here, we're going to see what the, what the cream mash with the because the potato um, hot. We're going to see about this one there, right? So we have a potato masher here. I'm going to um, get on all these potatoes. Right? You know, Randall will come and do this. Yeah, and let's see. I want to see around. I want to set a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, mash it. Now with your foot, you know. Oh God. That's my foot. I'm gonna mash it up. I use that. I use that for you. I'm trying to remember mash it. Anyone? Three, one, the four fingers or the five fingers or. No, I can't get them. The four finger one. So we're going to be mashing up this. This is our cream mashed potato recipe, right? Yes, we put them as a fanda. You can see the hardly see your handle on the set. What do I want to see? Huh? You can see my fixing cars. Fixing air condition. Air condition. Fishing. Hiking. Oops. Are they looking good? They're all good. Right. Yes, sir. 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 Why put it too? Oh god, Tony, it's too corrupted, right? yes. So we throw in some cheddar cheese. If you have the the mozzarella cheese, you can put the mozzarella cheese also. Right? What is she's looking so? He just wanna taste it. Now we're uh -huh. wide looking so. Right? Mama the last time when your teeth teeth cheese go went on with you. The chicken. I mean the chicken. Right, we are in a piece of the cream cheese. Cream. Any cream cheese are your choice you want to use? Why well, feel like this brand? You feel like that if you have cream cheese, right? It's a water brand? Yeah, and then we already use other brand here, right? No. Recently. It's all easy for the dog to cheese. Alright, this is so. I know so. Why not cheese is cheese, yes? Now you have the cream cheese. This is cream cheese, Randell. Only what she can't even look my pack. Nah. Oh, we do. 
There's a kind of sour cheese, right? For all who, all who wondering. There's a kind of sour cheese. They say go good with crackers. Yes, it does. That is so, so you're nice. about half of the cream cheese that you hold in. I have the earlier. Oh. <laughs> I have the now. Right, we're gonna mix up this. Cause you're using this as a potato hot, right? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Easy, so it might pull it down fast. Nah, it don't say that. All you say, don't say that. Guys, this is this. Baba, I think I'm going to deliver that cream cheese we just make. With this, with pepper shrimp. You put this in your plate, like, let me say, like this. And you just put, make a little hole in the center, like where you just put for dal. And you throw your pepper shrimp inside, and while you're eating, you dip it from inside and eat with the shrimp. Mm -hmm. The pepper shrimp and the um, cream mashed potato. Mouth watering for that. Always. Right, you put in a little fresh side. Well, this is frozen side, right? Guys, this can't stay outside long, eh? Like, if you leave it, if you leave it overnight, if you leave it overnight, it will spoil. Oh. Unlike outside, it will spoil. A little black pepper. Mm. We boil the potatoes with some salt, right? So that's the only salt we use, the only salt thing we use. We call this cream mashed potato, guys. Now, is the next main ingredient? Or if you can't remember, you see? Parsley. Nope. Oh. Milk. Tanisha milk. I, I just see it. Pick up the pack. You want some? Taste it, Daddy. It will taste nice. Let me see. Cream cheese. Yummy, yeah. yeah, my tummy. Alright, so this is how it is here now guys, you mix up this with well. I mix that up Yes, Randall, we all know that. My favorite time coming up just now. Eating time. <laughs> no tasting time for the cream potato. Nah, what about this one? Why? <laughs> guys, you have to taste it. Yeah, taste it. Guys, it's a little dry still. The part of the milk, milk again. Well, carnish and milk. Milk is bad. I say, what a little creamy. You don't want it too stiff, you want it to dry. But, guys, you think with this one, it get cool. Okay, let's get very stiff. Eh? Smelling already. I want to taste it, I want to smell. <sighs> Nisha, you want to taste that what are you making there? Eh? Me too. Okay, yeah. so this is it here. This is one of the side dish. The wifey take a taste now. Yeah, wifey don't like nothing better. Right? Oh. Hmm. Only right. watch it. Mm. Is it good? Yeah. Is it anything? Yeah. Can I say something? The grilled fish. <laughs> so, <laughs> okay, this is it here. Yeah? If you can keep this warm, better. Like, if you have a little warmer, you can put it in the warmer, keep it a little warm, right? So, we'll have the cheese. Huh, boy. I tell a little bit, they watch how much you use a handful she won't. That's all, Mr. Hi, guys. So, this is it for this. We're going to cover down this here. And we're going to start to see about the fish. Me too. When you drill in the, when you do in the fish. We're helping Ali. Right. Right, when you see about the, um, when you do in the fish, you'll be grilling it just one time, right guys? So stay tuned, we'll come back with you. Right guys, we're back here again. We're going to see about the fish, me and Usha. We're going to see the season up the fish now, right? So we wash all the fish with lime and flour right guys when i was washing the fish i take the lime rub it in inside the fish all over right you can see i clean i take a knife and scrape all the inside of the fish here to get out any little fine guts right clean i take the lime and scrub it underneath so we go and mix the seasoning what i would do i wouldn't season my fish here 
I would season my fish in, make my seasoning paste in the bowl and paste the fish with it after. So you know everything in there and you get it equal, right? Mm -hmm. So you're doing with the fish now. You're just making a few little slices, right? Right, on the both sides. I just said the seasoning and it's going inside it. Hi right, guys. Now it's five crow crow. This is the crow crow that well, we, we bought this today at Master Duck Farm. I will show you the clip. I will, I will show you that clip where we um that how much meat we buy we bought there and um how much it came up really good. The prices and it was really good on it. So I'll show you that clip right after this here with the damn fish. Now you could cut off the fish head if you want. I just leave it. But dad likes fish head on him, so he might eat it. <laughs> right? I, love, I don't want no fish head in my one. <laughs> Okay, so one more? Yeah, one more. So it's some nice size crew crew probably over by the other side probably out a foot long probably. I put my ears. Alright. Because daddy make a noise. Alright. Daddy make a noise. Right. So, so you don't see what we're gonna see all the sauce, right? Now we have everything cut up to do with fish other than the seasoning. So we're gonna do the seasoning process in here. So we added some grind from some processed seasoning, green seasoning. Mix a little extra, right? Okay, remember we had to rub inside the belly, all over we had to rub it, right? Processed garlic, fresh processed garlic, plenty garlic, right guys? Remember these, these things, especially garlic, is our main, our main flavor in this thing, right? Right, so we're adding some maggi. Mm. We're adding a bit of salt. Can you some this? Some fish seasoning. We got this just now. Some sars and tropical. It's I'll leave it in this bottle now so you guys go know well what it is I'm using. <coughs> um, a little bit of paprika. It's sauce. Hmm? Pepper. Pepper? No, we have pepper, pepper, pepper. You want some pepper sauce there? Huh? Mm -hmm. Okay. The chef say had pepper sauce all here. The on the bowl, see. Good idea, this one has. This is my pepper sauce with all the pepper sauce in it. A nice little spice. I say with yes. Add a little water. Okay. And you mix it up this, right? Put this too. Hmm? Put this. Yeah, that's how we go, we go dress the fish with after, baby. Right, so you see? Hmm. They didn't smell. They didn't see it. Smell it. Smell it over like we did. Smell real nice. More water, isn't it? Hi guys. So we going on. Rub down the fish now. But before we rub it down, you see what we use? We using foil, and we using the old school leaf and then right fig leaf, <laughs> banana leaf. So we gonna show you how we gonna do this leaf now. And we're going to show you the process with the. So you can make this like in. I, I have five croco there. You can make this like in five share. So you know, well, you, you, you get enough seasoning in every one. Okay, this, is, this is a lot of seasoning. That's a one fish, guys. You go teeth out of it from here. Teeth out of it from here. This is my version of um, a roast fish. Right, so this is it here. So I do it here like five I portion off. So this would be for one one fish, so we know 
one fish not getting too much than the next one, right? This look like this look like okay. Right? So we just take with all the leaves and them already wash, you can see the water on the leaf, right? And we just kind of soften the leaf a little bit. Right, it's again soft already. Mm -hmm. If you do have the leaf, it's okay. You could just use the foil. We just go in a little, you know, I'm going to show you every little. But it won't stick up in the foil? No. This will help the fish not stick into the foil. No, you say if they don't have the leaf. Yeah, you can use it as a normal foil. But it will not stick up? No, no, it will stick a little bit, but um... You don't have to put well, like some... <coughs> some oil or butter or something nah. on the foil. Okay, guys, so this is it here for this. Come. Right, I'm just going to mix up this movie, you see? She done separate up the thing already. So let me put this one side here. Let me get my this cutting board. You got only cut fish in it, so it's okay. Now I really don't know how we're gonna wrap this out. We're gonna try, right? Nobody in perfect. So, okay, cut it in half. Yeah, something like this. But that fish is getting so big. No, you just wrap it to help it a little bit, right? Uh -huh. In the foil, we are send this so in the fish, close it and wrap it right. Yeah, we'll do one by the time. All right, so now I want to season it first on the foil because the leaves go to the palate. But I know she'll do cut us, baby, and don't play with our scissors. I said, she'll do cut. Oh, why you didn't rest, rest the fish on top of the leaf and season it? No, not yet because you want to turn and the fish is season it, the leaf go be. The leaf will be wrapping up and the leaf will tear. Right, so using one portion and you rub it down the fish, right? You using it in your hand, you're rubbing it in, it's how you go in all here. A fish getting a nice massage, boy. Uh -huh. Right, you rub the outside, like go into the side. So that's why we put the leaf as yet, right? Even this helper. <laughs> right, so you use one already, so you see we know by using too much seasoning, right? Yeah, you use one. Make sure I don't mix up this, this seasoning, please. Right, so you're rubbing all by the head. One inside you're rubbing the belly. the belly, straight down, massaging it into it, right? Now if you want to do this, and you want to, um, I take out my fish eye, I don't like fish eye. I don't like to see the fish eye, guys. So I take out, I remove all the ice on the fish. Right, the real massage it on. Right, you see inside? Yeah. Properly well seasoned, right? And a little helper. A little helper. Buddy. Right, so we're going to rest back this here. I want to leave now. I have mommy. Right. We're going to add in the ingredients now. Randall, how many ingredients you gonna add to the little ingredients? Look at the only table. Alright, so we have some onions, pimento, tomatoes, we don't have all this, right? So you can move all this. Make some space. Yay, I don't want it is going to put in this in there. Daddy, you have to put it. Daddy, you show you with the put it. I put it. So you do like our pizza here, right, guys? <coughs> some board. So I put in some. <coughs> <coughs> right, so I put in some in the belly. So big, yeah. I can't even see when you put anything in the belly. I got to 
putting some stuff and some pine in the belly also. Me too. Me too. Papi said, Daddy, come. Nice. Right, shy. You know your stuff in casket, you guys? That's your stuff in the belly now, right? <laughs> Pain all mushroom. Me too. Now, I don't fry the mushroom or the pizza one because. I nice time. Right? Because remember, it's going to bacon moist, right? Pain all. A few pimento inside. Right? We'll put this on top, baby, after. We paint some cheese. Now we. We was going to get the, the five spice. The five. The five cheesy Mexican one. My wife forget to pass because she was driving. Mm -hmm. Walking was driving. Okay. Right? Do you see this stuff here? Right? Just for one more thing, eh? What? One more thing, eh? Hmm? One more thing. Can you get that? Right? We put another barbecue sauce. Inside it, a little thing. Right? So you stuff and fold it. Right, we paint some tomato. Now we were supposed to go at the market, and I was supposed to get some of the rosemary, the rosemary leaf, if I didn't the seasoning, and it slip all mine clean. Paint some onions. Right, so the some of the dry rosemary. Right. Nene, have she? Yeah. Yeah, she has. So let's go get some from here. Right, so I put in a little olives in it, you know, olives have a little kind of a little, a little bitter taste, so it might help with the freshness and also. Mm. Put some inside the belly. Mm. I like a pizza. Yeah, you can put in some carrots because you remember when, when this fish leg or this sauce, guys, this going and taste amazing. This carrot will taste like a flavored carrot with the chunky veg, right? Mm. So you put in some carrots. There's enough carrots, but small. Yes, you put the small one. Alright, now we just paint some slices. One lime, cut in very thin slices. Mm -hmm. And we just paint like out what that means by the head here. And a small piece here. I put the small piece. Right? That's nice what I child. Alright, then sprinkle some cheese. No, they never went for the rosemary thing. Me too. Me too. Alright, nice time. Right. And we can do those today. Yeah. That's so funny. Hmm? We we'll also put some fresh celery also. Fresh side. No, I say we also put fresh celery. Uh -huh. I put in some back. side. This is the frozen side. Right? Here we go. 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 Here we and have it like this and just wrap it in yeah, the foil. Yeah, mama the string. I don't know if she had the string. Right guys, so we wait on the rosemary. Right, let's bring up the rosemary. We'll come back to you again shortly. Stay tuned. Okay. Hey guys, what's up? This is the clip we're going to show you where we went on Master Duck Farm and we got some of the stuff like where we cook on a regular basis. So we're going to show you that what we get and the prices we get it for. Um, some very reasonable prices. Right? We have Nusha here. Nusha went to the duck farm, she was hoping to see ducks in her farm, right? Not knowing the place was named as Master Duck Farm. So she's a bit upset that she didn't see any ducks on the farm, right? So here, let me show them. That's what we get here. I'll show you, we got some lamby kongs. This is Master Duck Farm, right? So let's go open it and show you. This is like two pongs, right? So there's the lamby kongs that we get, already clean, as I say. Oh, we're using this on casket. We got here, you see the nice packaging these also. Yeah. This is like for $40. Just clean also. Just clean also. Right? So you guys feel probably about, probably about, probably about 15 to 20 casket here probably. About 15 average. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. About 12, 12, 12, 12 around there. A nice size, not the big ones. Let me get the king for sure. What you pong, what you pong in this? Five and a half pong for one thirty five fresh fresh kingfish. Right, you can see the blood coming out. Yeah, very very nice fresh kingfish. So we buy two packs in it. This one is five point seven eight pong. So you can have it today for twenty five dollars a pong, which is a really good a really good price. You can buy a pack of smoker in twenty one dollars. 
Look here at some crow crow, watch how much crow crow we get for $62. You got like one, two, three, four, five nice size crow crow. Mm -hmm. But guys, you know what we're going to do on this, right? So I think this is even, you would see it only going to do with this fish. Then we get some shrimp here, some nice size shrimp. Right? So you just show you know, this clip to show you we get, right? For the nice size shrimp. I got your hand. Some nice size, right? And we get some chicken, four whole chicken for 150. Not, not bad size. Right? Right? For $20. And we get a big, huge cabbage. Watch my my and wifey and can cover it with $23. Guys, that price real good for that. Right, so all the goes, right? We got some crystal. Well, you got the crystal fiend there? Yeah, two baby crystal fiend. And all the whole bill, the entire bill for this came up about seven hundred and something dollars. Which was really good. So we get fish, smoker and shrimp, cascadoo, lamb, conch, chicken. Well, we get kingfish, we get crow crow, we get cascadoo, like three types of fish. And there's two whole big kingfish we got. Plus the smoker and plus the shrimp, plus the lamb, plus four chicken, pimento, the cabbage. Christopher, you got everything about 70, 85 in the bill game. Right? So it was really good. Good prices, guys. And I want to thank, um, I spoke with the guy at Master Duck Farm. He told me a guy came for some lamb becomes this morning at the farm so we just appreciate that the thanks you're listening by the way the stuff on it they get the good stuff right so the guy who went to master dog to try the and he bought some lamb becomes when they try that when they try that they can um send some send some pictures with what you did with it right so we're gonna get back to the menu there now just now guys so stay tuned all right guys we're back here we have some of the rosemary and then show some not too much, a little bit. My body says very high in flavor, eh? My body fish. But fish, the most, the, 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 the season I could use, the most season I could use is good, eh? Right? So let the parallel parsley. Me too. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Right? Apple doll. And you put in a little pepper flakes. Me too. Me too, yeah. I want to show you how to bench it watch. Right? Good job. Good job. <laughs> Open this here. <laughs> Put this one on this side. You can kind of wrap it in like a gyro, right, guys? See, only two ends. Right, this is one. It's one crook a bit heavy, probably about a little more than a pound, a little so much. Right, so it's only a fig leaf and you wrap it in foil. You get a nice flavor. We go in and rest this on the grill plate. Right, so this one complete, right? Mm -hmm. And we're going to start with the next one now. So next one, same thing, foil. We so just say one more again, and then we will do all the rest. Right, we'll do all the rest after. This one, this one. Which one? This one? <laughs> right. We'll make this one now. Right? So we're using the seasoning. So we have four portions of seasoning remain. Right? So we just show this whole thing one time, right? Again, kiss sounding trouble. Mm -hmm. I see you rubbing on the fish with it. Massaging that fish. The fish like it. The fish like it? Mm -hmm. You like the sarge? Mm hmm. Uh -huh. You don't know that? Now I know. I like it. Yeah. The fish like it. And right, they push it all in the head and thing here because my body head. No. Here we get a lot of the flavor, right? Don't push it in my head now. Nah. Not in your head now. Nah. Oh, no, Guys, you know, some of you have been asking questions. Not, not some of you, a, a very few percentage of you. And um, you know about where's the cooking, where's I have. Guys, you have to remember, this shot, this one I'm showing to you guys here, is from my humble home, right? It's not a studio kitchen. It's not a, you know, it's something that we, a kitchen that we do to come on to do this. This is our humble home 
our kitchen and our humble home. Right? It's just direct from our kitchen to yours. So you can know how much love that we put into this. I guys, so you just wanted some of you all to know that. So we're not perfect, guys. Don't forget to stop the eye. Yeah, stop the side already. But no. well, that season go down already, head and the night. <laughs> and it's baking. Alright, so you want to put some stuff for that, you know? Put some onion. Put some onions we have in your hand. Right? Put a couple of slices of tomato here, too. Put some onion for daddy. Put some of these small onions, baby. Oh, small Bring some mushroom yeah. inside. Put some small ones for daddy. Some pines. Hmm. 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 Pimento. You put some cheese to close up this here. You put a pimento on it on top. Me too. Right, so you probably say that I miss something and do it all the front. Me too. Guys, that lock into that, that fig leaf. Rain, rain. That lock into that fig leaf. Rain, rain. And it's a lot of flavors. It not, the flavors not going anywhere. The flavors, flavors staying right inside there. Right? Right, so you go raise up this here. Where do you think leaf? This way or next? Yeah, right, just here. Alright, right, so we'll put this on this side. Alright. Just cut all this. Edge. Yeah, we'll cut all that. We see this is us. Right? Guys, if I can hear, remember what it is up on top? Tomatoes. And some tomatoes. Some, <laughs> some, put some carrots, Baba. Okay. Put some carrots. Put some yeah. carrots here. Come all up here with the tomatoes. Alright. You put green on. Do you put the olives on top here? I'll put the olives on top here. Put some here. Put, put carrot here. So this is you cooking today? I put some cheese on top. Yeah, that's all. Put carrot here. Alright. How are the pagans? Your cheese? Some more again. Onions you can put again on top. Okay. Okay. I'm going to put that's some. enough, baby. That's enough. Is there any one there? No, that's too big for there. Oh. Right? right? Give me a small one. Okay, that's good there. Thanks, baby. Right? Oh, one there. Oh, put some lime now. Put two pieces of lime for daddy. One. No, put one here. Right? Let yeah. me put it under the fish. We so also put the lime first. Right? Oh. You put oh, you forgot. Put this piece here. Right. Right. And the cheese time. Cheese time. Me too. Ah, put some. Oh. Oops. That, that is okay, baby. Here. Oh. Are you ready to cheese the fish? Me. You only paying everything by the tail. <laughs> you ain't paying nothing to the fish here. No. So guys, I'm sorry. I didn't have the mozzarella cheese or the five cheese. Okay. That would have looked nice. I only would have looked amazing. Right guys, I didn't squeeze any lime juice too. Right? I didn't squeeze because I was I forgot to put the barbecue sauce. Oh my god, you forgot the sauce, man. Right? That's all for the police spoon for my... Look at that here. For my olives? Right, so why if you don't want olives, then she wants us now, baby, just now. Why if you don't want the olives and she don't want no tail? I mean no head. Right, so you put in all the olives. You love this. That's a table. You know, so I don't know. See, the one I sell. And I a kind of sour kind of taste. So that will help with the fish also. Yeah, the other thing too. Chili with the Right. Right. Right, so you spray some rosemary. Sprinkle some panadi on top. And some parsley. With a pepper flakes. Sprinkle, sprinkle it, Mama. Sprinkle it up with some pepper pen. Yep. Well, plenty in your hands. You don't try that, Daddy. Here. All right. Now, my partner, my partner, I'm going to be watching this. And you get your rest of the part of my baby. I put one in Put some more. Richard, my partner from Freeport. Should you bring my detail? 
Yes, Richie. <laughs> this is he food in our guys. You gonna be watching this, and you gonna see my partner and call me, boy. Don't worry, Richard. <laughs> I mean, he's only gonna make for you. I'm gonna make for you. I promise you. Right, 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 so we're closing this here. Wrapping this tight. I'm pulling tight, right? Pull back this one tight. Now, so guys, I am. Um, we are wrapping it. I'm not planning to open it while I'm cooking because I'm wrapping it tight here. I don't want any of the juice and the sauces to come out. Right? So this is it again guys, right? Yeah. So this is one, this is two, right? We're going to finish out three more, so it is our time process. We're going to take me down and finish out this. Yeah, we're going to do that now, baby, right? And you will see the clip now with Rob and Master the Farms earlier today, right? Um, and you will see the meat that we got and the prices and how reasonable it came up. Right, guys? So look at... Done here. This one is the last one. You know, so the, the last, last one will be the best one. So you know that I mind. This one get all the cheese. <laughs> this one get everything. Right? You know? Oh, listen to this. Feeling it, yeah, boys. And I come. I think we'll mark. We come too. Can we catch you fresh, fresh? We gonna do one of this for them, right? Just like this. It's here in Nassau. I don't think. So I tell you, look how fun that fish looking. Right? <laughs> I think that's part F1 now on. Or W for white. For white, yeah, something. I'll give you a piece of foil there. I'll give you a piece of foil again. Oh, it's how fun this one looking. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the last one is be the best one. It's really not cheese. Okay, enough pineapple? Yeah. Yeah, so <laughs> this one is for Bushman and Nikia yeah, boys. I don't know when you catch you fish doing this one earlier. Yeah? Roast fish like this. Direct by the sea. Alright guys, so this is it here. Five. One, two, three, four, five. Right? Look, this one came in trouble. Not again. No, the whole on the negative. Yeah, trouble fix that. I feel cause that. Alright, so we put in a little. This is this one up here, that's the last one. Yeah, no, I want few one, eh? <laughs> yeah. Right? So we're gonna light up the grill, we're gonna clean up. We'll show you the garlic potatoes, we'll show you everything. All right, guys, we're back here. We're going to start just cleaning the grill. We're going to start with some garlic potatoes. After we're gonna do the fish, because we want the fish hot when we eat them, right? With the cheese and all these things. All right, guys, so um, today, which will be yesterday for you, all right? We didn't get a reply, you know we try our best to reply to most of the comments How we went out today, the dog farm and thing We didn't get much time so you realize some of the comments that we didn't get back to Right guys, so forgive us for that, but you know we try our best every day To read the most of the comments and reply most of the comments, right? Right, so we're going to start, which one are we going to do first? This one or the... The... Oh, the next one is cream mashed potato? Yes! Oh, me. Alright, we're going to do the garlic potatoes, right? So the grill is a little extra hot, you will find, you will find the place a little smoky, right? So, if you guys who, who don't want the potatoes on the healthy side, if you want to use the sweet potatoes, you can only use sweet potatoes, right? You don't have, I will tell you like everything I'm doing, right? You know, right? You want to, um, I would show everything I'm doing and you can replace it also, right? No matter anything, if you do have, you can use it, right? So this is the garlic butter sauce I have from the grill, right? I usually put some of this. I'm not seeing any blood, it's still sticking. Oh, you're going to do this? Okay, my heart time. This is. Alright. So some of this here. Now if, you, if, if, you, if you want, watch here, if you want you can throw some raw garlic also in it, and all that garlic potato, you might not have all the garlic in you, that I might have, because I put some of the garlic powder, right? Let's go into the, um, 
Well, you said you put it all up. So by, by them price, man. Price, man, yeah. So if you do have this and you're using normal garlic, you could. You have some pine remain from these sea fish. So we train in the pine, everything with it. Not really anything, right? This is the garlic, but it's alright. And now it's mine. Like chicken. Nice. <laughs> I remember this for the dough was boiled, right? It was boiled potatoes. I just fed it a grill to get a little grill flavor and That's smart and real good You might need to give me the neighbors and then come outside So do you find the work out? Do you find a little smaller? Do you find a little big? I feel like I'm in the kitchen again Yeah, when you're making this grill potatoes This garlic potatoes also real good That's the first thing it's to finish yeah. When you're making it, they're not special Right, also guys If you want You could do it with all this, I, I did it with the skin, I boiled it with the skin, I diced it with the skin, sorry, from raw, and we boil it with the skin, everything. We scrub all the skin properly before we boil it, for you with the skin. If you don't want it, just peel it, do it like the mashed potato, and also put it like a mashed, a mashed garlic potato, or you can do it like this garlic potato, all you want. It's up to you what choice you want to do it on. And I'll say that all different ways you could do it, is that it? Try and open the um, bottle. Yeah, I feel like I'll do something like that. Yeah, because you need to I'll just show some from here, right? Yeah. Okay, we'll stick it in there right now. This garlic, this, this, this is the garlic butter. Go into the garlic potatoes. It's smelling so good. And I say you don't have to use the garlic butter if you want. You can just use the garlic. You can use the garlic powder with the garlic, if there's the garlic alone only. You want to put a little olive oil in it to help it out with the to saute in the grill properly, you can do that. And the next finishing thing in this is the parsley, right? Also you, I got a temperance mark. Yeah, you notice you ever buy this and you see that green thing is the parsley, right? So you put in a little extra parsley. Some of you like it, some, some of you like the food, like this burn. I think all this and mix it with it, burn like a burn, a little more brownish. So the mass small bowl here. Okay. Randall bustle. Is it too small or just good? I'll too small. Probably only that one. This one? Yeah, I have it. I can't wait to this. The garlic butter really helps with the flavor, guys. It really, really helps with the flavor. And it smells good. Yeah, it smells good. No more water in boy. Then the silver, you're more over water. Not me. Guys, remember if you want that grill like this to buy, I will decide, I decide I will make it. You can call on my number 308 8008. According to the size of what we could work a good price. Right, wherever it is, you could work a good price and you know let me know how much you have, wherever. And I don't know if, if it's feasible enough for me to make it up wherever you have, right guys? It's just... Um, oh, and the grill have a season. Yeah, it's have a season the grill also, eh? It takes like two days. Two days to season, if you want to do the season process, you can season it. Or if they want you to season it and... Yeah, it'll take a while to season, guys. You know, it's not cooking. It's, cooking is not the first step to season it. So that soaking process, the metal is going to go through to get the... Not to get the metal flavor. Hey right, guys, you see, look at this. Put garlic potatoes, right? Right, so I put this one side here. I will clean back the grill. You will come back then? Yeah, and that's all. I'm going to make a little love to some, to some yeah, amazing people here, yeah? right? So, no, no, probably fish one then, I will probably fish one then. All right, we'll clean all right, we'll stay tuned, guys. We're coming back just now. <laughs> <laughs> Be mine, what you want to do? Clean all the grill first yeah, and then, the then, right, yeah. Stay tuned. Hi, right, guys, you're back here. We had the fish here. We had the plate hot. It's only see the plate smoking. So, you're going to raise the fish. You're going to get three in. Yeah, you're going to get three in, man. Yeah, you see the one more pointy in up there, like a little unicorn thing here. I'm mine. There's a tree fit. I hear that crackling here, ain't that? Right, everything done inside there, steam inside already. 
You wanna let us cook down here? See how nice this grill work, guys? You can hold three whole fish. Now, I prefer use the crow crow. All of us love crow crow, right? Wherever fish you choose is your choice. Like, if you want these red fish, if you want the we love crow crow because I can add a flaky fish, right? So, that is why we use crow crow. Right? So, any fish you want to use, are your choice to do it. Um, if it is you want to use king for slice itself, you do it the same way, wrap it, you can do like three slices in one foil, something like that, right guys? So, right then let's grill in here, you want to send a little love, you want to send some love to some amazing people again, so our subscribers, remember guys, our subscribers is our family, right guys? So, you want to join the family, the Trini out and about family, you need to, need to subscribe, you need to hit that subscribe button. You need to hit the notification bell, like the videos, comment below, right guys? So we're gonna send some love to Natalia and Sam from Orlando, Florida. We're gonna send some love to Adrian, Debbie Singh from Williamsville. Right? We're gonna send some love to Sakina Mohammed. We're gonna send some love to Bridget Luke, Melissa Asia, um, Asia. Right? Kamala from Florida, Sarah Jones. Hi right, guys, I'm um, Roger Balcaran, Christa, Christina from from Ontario, Ontario, Canada, Sherry Boise, Cool Kid 29, Playboy Son, Sonny One, Nigel 786, Nelly Ram Roop, Shara Miller. Right, we're sending our love to each and every one of you. Right, so we're going to get the fish a little turn now. A little hot, I see why if you're going to clip us fast enough, see? Sorry, Daddy. Yeah. Are you hungry now? Oh, Jesus Christ. Can you get it out of quick turn there? I'll go turn it back after. So, how long is it? Because it's here real hot. Real hot right now. Oh, yeah. How, right? Long, how long do you think we first got to take the I believe about probably about 10, 15 minutes. Yeah. Because you remember, we have a lot of things to cook inside it. We want the pineapple. We want the, we want the pineapple to cook. We want the mushroom to cook, we want the tomatoes, pimento, sive, the cheese, the carrots, everything to cook and steam. So remember all these things we put in here guys, is a Lego, a lot of flavor inside the fish, right? Not the carrots too much, but the tomatoes will have a nice flavor, the lime, lime slices also. The sive, because the one that you, I, I forget the probably side, I forget to put the side, we open it up and put the side, right? Um, so all of the sive and all of the Lego have great flavor. Right, the onions, the cheese, everything. The pine especially with like a, a, a amazing flavor. Right, so that's why we want to cook and let all the, all, the, all, the, all the vegetables ingredients season to, to burst inside our fish. Right guys? Yeah, the, yeah, yeah, describe and I'm a molto. Water, right? You don't like me. Right, so. If only see my face expression when he's saying that, oh God. Right, but um, I think I'll stop that. Nigel said made six Nelly Ramrup, Shara Mela, Ramnath family, Ay Rajesh wife, Rajesh and his wife, Vashti, and his son Ajay, we sending all of you. Indra Depchan from USA, Vidyan Sun Sunil. No. Yeah, Vidyan. Oh Sunil, yeah. Vidyan Sunil. And Devika from St. Augustine. Sandra and Edward Pasad. Mr. and Mrs. Janki Rupsan, Rup Singh, Lisa Jamada from Union Hall, Lisa um, Samuel and Diane from Don Miguel, Krista Rampasad from Vista Bella, Bernadette and Sharon from Bataria, Chandra Khan, Alicia Mohammed, Konat um, Fevikyu, um, Shilling and Kevin from Princess Town. I hope I pronounced your name correct. Right? Or should Shalini. Shalini. Okay, Shalini and Kevin, sorry. <laughs> Lachman Mana, Bean Tongue Baby, Nigel Samru from Toronto, and Edwin Ramki soon. Mm -hmm. Right, we're selling all off to you. I'm turning fish now, man. Okay, Maddie fish here now. Guys, I want to show you this step by step. You know what, I'll tell you, um, probably new, the first time viewers might say, you know, the video looking a long. Trust me, the video is enjoyable. You can sit down with your family and watch it, right? Um, it's kids friendly also, right? So just in case you didn't know it's kids friendly. 
so you can have your kids watch it too you know we try we don't try to promote anything like anything negative or anything on it so it will be kid friendly i can promise you that and we will show you the step by step detail with everything that we do right because we don't want you to miss an ingredient we don't want to we don't want to be just want to show you from everything that we do from our heart and from our hands in our kitchen in our humble kitchen right guys so look at the fish you looking here now she just steaming out and level it's just level the steam already so that crackling up inside you guys um i want to send some love also to imran Sierra and carissa from canada edward passat from north carolina Riza M from your Princess Leah. Princess Leah sending that for you, Riza M. And Trisha Ram Singh, Israel Mangla, Richard Jones, Jai Pasad Ram Sarup. And also, um, and also I want to send some love to one of um, He lives in close by us, Kevin Mangro. Right? He called me today. He have a bottle of rose pepper for me. You want to pass for it? He bought something for the kids, some snacks, and then, um, you know, bro, we appreciate that. He just want to, he just want to give something to the kids and. You know, to the kitchen, so wherever it is you want to get, bro, you tell me tomorrow. You tell me tomorrow, right? But if he gaze in there, she watch man gaze at the phone on the phone, so. <laughs> watch her, let me realize that's not only what just came. Just rewind it back and see if phone's going to go down. She stand up there and check she now. Just gaze in. No, I'm so hungry. That's what he's doing. I need to tell him that I'm hungry. Yeah. <laughs> right? So Kevin Mongrel is selling all after you, bro. We really appreciate that. That he bought he bought a, a bottle of roast pepper for me. He says some snacks for the kids. He has something for chow. For the wife, he didn't call it chow. Right guys? So as I say, we just send in love. The reason we take this couple of minutes, a few minutes, to send all the love to you guys is because it's just to appreciate, just to give back. But we appreciate that you comment and you take the time to comment on it below. Right guys? And um so that is all the most we can do to give our love, right guys? So stay tuned, we're gonna let us cook up a little 10 minutes ago, turn it. We'll turn it a little bit, right? While we cook in there. And probably we'll try to open it. Okay, kind of open it, we'll try to open it. And get and get to show how that look, right guys? So stay tuned. We'll be back shortly. I don't want to see Anusha one more. Anusha, come down want to see her. Come, come fast. <laughs> she take it, she's strolling, she tired, come. Oh baby, come fast. Come see this. She's coming, she's coming, guys. I know all the answer yes, I want to see she now. She eating eyes. This child loves eyes. I don't know why. Right? You wanna say hi? Say hi viewers. All in here, baby Ellie in the background. Ellie wanna to come too? Ellie watching. Now Ellie the little baby. Only watching she sister right through. What? What does she eye on she watch? <laughs> watch she eye on watch watch you turn down she's a star watch and she's staying quiet she's, she's smelling smell like, the food she's smelling she food like she that don't smell like quality baby tea see, watch it no no watch see? <laughs> she loves she's a star too bad you know you love ellie yeah yeah big tita now they big tita in she room and eh? you're called big tita to come and lie with me and eh? <laughs> right guys Stay tuned for this pretty baby to come back. Ready to tell them? Alright yeah. guys, we're back here. It's been about 10 minutes now. We just put in my arm, um, the cream mashed potatoes to hot a little bit up there. And the grill let's get a little warm, we just rest on the tip of the grill on top there. To get back a little warm for the seat. Are you ready, fish? So this one was here, the flame is right, right here. So I brought this one, was here, I bring it, bring it here. And I slide down these two. So this one is like a lot of sauces now. You hear it bubbling up. So let me just show you a little sneak peek. Let me just see how it opened yet. So. Let's just see it crackling. Hello, you want to come? First, that comment it has mouth. So first, that dress up real nice today and all. See, why if you didn't want to share drugs? Why if you just have nice to this evening? I find she just never run on nice these days, you know. Uh -huh. I ain't got what my hair. What's my hair? I can't, nobody can see it. <laughs> and, and she just handed you a camera. Eh? So she's actually dressing up for me. Yeah, and they told me the other day I was 
Oh, the gaze and our gaze and yeah. Hey guys, so you open it up all the way here. That's what you can see. I'm going to choose my own eyes. You look at nice. Smell nice, you fish cook? Yeah, I want to check it now. Hey guys, you see that? Oh, God, in. Right. Okay, we're going to try it and see. Okay. Yeah, watch. Yeah, why? If you think the first is all, you all agree? Yeah, that must agree. Why? If you can take the first is. A nice special look, watch it, guys. Right? Why did you just have the fork? No. It's nice? Yeah, boy. I eat mutton fair. Mm-hmm. Cotton? Yeah. Right, so let me taste it now. That is real good boy. Go let mama let me know the taste it, eh? Yeah. Hide it and taste now. Hey guys, gorgeous. Make cook nice and juicy. Right? Mama out water in for more boy. This Epic. is amazing, not salty. Just not, right. That's right. Yeah. Carol, so can I get cook nice and all? Oh, right. they look mama on them. Lime, everything. Then the Jones in the back there with the churn on them. Mm, I'm going right. to show mama on them a little bit, right? Huh? Yeah, go ahead. Mama. Watch. Then being the Jones in the back here by the self, they you know they can a little entertain me a little this bit. One, this share one, the joke. This one sneeze and that one jump at the <laughs> <tip>, mama. <laughs> <laughs> mama, you got a lash? Oh, God. Let's go back to the top of 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 the top I leave it for about two minutes again. It, it trust me, good. I just want some of that water to come off a little bit. Right, you see all that water bubbling there? Some of you might prefer it with the water, but it's a lot of water. Right, I know the water might be the, might be the flavor in the fish, but I don't want to turn over the fish anymore. You see, I turned it here earlier, and the sauce is starting to come out here. Mm. So you just leave it right there. Come right, let's steam on the oil um, now. When you take it out and you open it, just sprinkle a little more cheese on top. A little cheese on top or something if they want. Yeah. But the guys on the healthy side, they do have to use the cheese if you want. Well, you fully smell this. Well, you smell this, guys. So all the people who know. Um, Watch now, I hear the jackpot, you know. As, like I follow no message with some. I don't know. Mm-hmm. You say, why, if you're lucky, you can truck man to cook. You know yourself who now comment, right? Yes, yes. They really say that. Either like Barry something or I'll get the name just on our Right? You say your wife is lucky because truck man could cook. Guys, a lot, a lot of truck man could cook here. Yeah? <laughs> I'm going to get a story when we used to, me and my cousin, he used to say, like years ago, he used to drive truck and I had my truck. And he come back from the pit hole every day. He go stop in a shop, them little shop in Valan, St. Two, for road running. He go come, he go buy a them loaf and them. them like, I know it's dollar loaf, you remember them guys? Long every dollar loaf. It's about dollar loaf. Two dollar loaf. Two can of sausage. You have it's like the lady shop tanti, the man knife day. My bottle of pepper sauce, you open up a rice on top she comes up with sausage. Put some pepper sauce and eat that rice day just so. So you see truck man no food from so, long time. So, so, survival. So nice so, survival. Nice survival. <laughs> but you see we learn, so we learn cooking, cooking, truck man. Most I bet real truck man to cook. Right here, yeah. Right, you have a nice truck pan and a lot of guys could cook it. Eh? A lot of guys. This guy back from um from Arima there, he said he showed me he's the, he just cook for the whole village and all also. Nice. And the back and his wife. Oh. Yeah, so he's sending love to you and all also, Mr. Bax and the wife. Right? So let me go let this bubble a little bit here. And we come back in this about five minutes time. We will take it out. Take out the little dish and then what is to eat, right? Okay, can I eat? So still right guys, we're back here. We go in and um, take all this fish now. And the guy was Budai Ramcharan. And he tell me, yes, why if you lucky, why if you lucky? With that truck man, I was telling about the sausage thing because 
We learn from young and bread and sausage start off with it. You know? But I was starting to cook before truck though. Bread and sausage. <laughs> Alright, so they saw this looking. Also, you want to send some love to Doreen and Maraj and Sarah, Sarah, Ransom. Send your love, love to you. <coughs> now looking good. Everything is active. Really. Nice man. Yeah, that's looking good. We knock a fish today, boy. Knock a fish today. Knock a grill today. Well, I'll grill them. Right? Wait, hold on. Am I going to eat it here? I'll eat it. You see, she has high tools there now. No, you hold with another side and take out the side with all the sauce and then pull out, you know. That's not going to be yours. Nice, you're doing it good, man. I teach you well. This is one. I teach you well, man. I think the next one. Two. Next bit. So I'll pull back this one. This one is in the middle. I'll pull back this one a little bit. Alright. Let me see how this one looking. Yeah, right. 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 That is the reason for the fig leaf is because of the, it's in the case of the foil, everything will be foil and and the um the feeling more than I saw. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice man. That's so so good, good with that cream potato. Yeah. I thought I did fig leaf cook it. He's looking so sexy. I can taste him in my mouth. Okay, so let me, go on, let me just leave this one a little bit. And we're going to check, let me check these two as well. No, you check one already, so yeah, check this one. Check this one. Is it hot? Hot, very hot. No, it ain't hot at all. I got it roast fish down by me and my feet. I'll watch this. Ooh, fresh meat. Yeah. Papa, come and see this. Right. And Papa, come and see. Come, Papa, like this. What? Grilled fish, boy. Roast fish. Roast fish. Right? Yeah, boy. I need real healthy food, eh, boy. I well cook inside. Mm -hmm. yeah. Pineapple, mushroom, what? Cheese, onion, pimento, carrots. Everything. Everything well, inside. Hi right, guys. So, we're going to finish all these here. Hi right, guys, and we'll get back. Mm. This is real tasty, and the potato with it, real tasty and nice. Right? What's your food, guys? What cream mashed potato, the garlic potato, and the fish. Drizzle with a little barbecue sauce, the butter garlic sauce, and the salt pepper sauce. That is the sauce, so in case you have the accent for it. Mm -hmm. That is just barbecue sauce, drizzle over it with the garlic butter. That's a healthy, delicious food. Mm -hmm. No oil. Tasty, no oil. Real nice, tasty. Roast fish, roast fish. Yeah, roast fish, yeah. Real top of the line. My mama said, Mama, look at this. No yeah, mama guy, right? no, no mama guy. No mama guy. <laughs> no mama guy. No mama guy. Mama. Hey, this potato tastes real good. The one with the skin. That grilled potato. Real nice. All tastes nice. Everything but I like this. You like the grilled one, eh? Yeah. 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 Real good. Nice mama. Uh, real flavor, boy. Real flavor. My numbers. I feel. Mm. Guys. What's my number? Yeah. Yeah. You get half, 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 half of the fish, right? Uh, uh, Remember the fish is the protein. Uh, the potato is carbs. It will uh, pull you. A little plate will full here, yeah? so it's not much you have to eat, right guys? Oh, this is a very full in meal. Right, so. The fish is real good. Yeah. yeah but real nice. Real good. I can't wait to eat, Mama. Don't make me drool now, Mama. Mama, you're torturing me. You're torturing me, girl. Right, guys, so this is it here. We're going to take out this one now. You probably next two on the grill. Mm-hmm. Right? Nice. You want, you want probably next two in it? 
the reason we went for the sauce to go down more in this one because you want it to you want the flavor to lock into the fish right mm -hmm. you see a lot of the sauce finish here mm -hmm. let me go right there one time with this all right so we have this one so stand and come and eat randall went home he had an emergency so he went home yeah hey guys so let's close about as the heat go remain in it all right so that's it here for my recipe on the roast fish but uh, the, the grilled garlic potatoes and the cream mashed potatoes all right guys so the recipe by me and wifey well little wifey doing everything to it now right yes so i have I must, to get some credit too must get some credit to her right and we just want to thank you all guys um did you guys notice we nearly reached 2000 subscribers so thank you so much thank you so much to all our subscribers our three out and about family each and every one of you who subscribe inspiring us also so when you all guys say thank you for this lovely meal in the comments and then that will be to say thank you for the support we appreciate everything you guys do for us right even the viewers and all that but if you need to subscribe yes to all who don't know how to subscribe they can ask the children and they can only subscribe once they can only subscribe once i said that yesterday right you can ask the children or you can ask somebody in the phone to check it how you to subscribe on youtube one more page and you'll see the subscribe button you can press the bell right so as i load a video we'll get the first to notify that i got the um uh, that i load a video right so guys as from deep in our hearts and treating out and about we want to say thank you to all of you and don't don't forget the four words family friends food and fun right and what is it, what life is all about right and don't forget to please mask up sanitize social distance anything that you go to please be careful and uh, that's it right guys so we just want to thank you again until i'm not edition we have a nice surprise meal to come in tomorrow yeah. why you say she ain't fancy it a simple simple meal very simple right and it, it is a tasty meal for a, 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 a favorite meal for all of you guys so guys so until again what we say Nakapot. yes guys this is it here cream mashed potato garlic gr grilled garlic potatoes roast fish pineapple mushroom tomato everything in it stay tuned guys for the full recipe by trouble and wifey yes guys so right before we go no we tell her we going just now there you forget to show you me and wifey eating wifey sit down here wifey done mashing in already wifey sticking on more water in the garden hi guys so this is it here I put on the butter garlic drizzle it with it. The garlic mashed potato. Yes. A piece of fish. Is the macaroni salad from the grill we had remain? I add some to it. Or just guys. Properly well cooked. Well flavor. All water in cut is a business. My no my no water. Hmm. Guys, watch this. And I ain't lying. There's no fake shopping on there. I've been real. Well, they know me, I'll just be real, right? Now, you'll fish sauce here. What's Onions. that? Onions. Pineapple. I'm going to take up everything. Pineapple. Piece of mushroom. A spoon over full right now. Hey, guys. Man, shaking me because I'm hungry. It isn't so good. The pineapple with the grilled, grilled potato tastes yes. real boss. Yeah, yeah. Pineapple, right? Pineapple is real good, isn't it? Guys, so this is the bomb. Love Telling you. Yeah? I feel like I can eat this some more again for lunch. This is so amazing. I don't mind me eating it for lunch now, but it's. Guys, you know like tomatoes? Some of you only need tomatoes like this. I know eat a piece. You will need to I do it onion whole like this and tomato. Pineapple. Everything save here inside this. Like like this, like the juices juices lock into everything here. Mm-hmm. Hi guys. What's that? 
That pineapple, what did what did grilled potato? What boy? Yeah. Is it bomb here? Yeah. What the potato? The pineapple I'm mixing with the grilled potato. What's now? Everybody like that. As more easy fish. Why if you take the belly part, eh? With all the stuffings. <laughs> Why if you take that part? I end up with the tail part. But that take the head I really eat the head. Right? So this is skin here. Yeah, chunky. Let's do this go real cut. We forget about the stuff. Guys, this is the um, uh, the bomb. You don't see any cheese, I do The cheese melts into everything. Yeah, the cheese. Watch now, this right. cup then. That's why I like cocoa. I cheese here, man. Yo, the mushroom. Love it. Yeah. The mushroom. She don't like mushrooms. She knows she does. And olives. Oh, look at the piece of cheese here, my mushroom. No, man. <laughs> You can't and be doing olives that. And all, taste real good with it. Yeah, the olives cook real good. You can't be doing mm -hmm. that. You can't film a mushroom. Guys, this is somebody for the stuffing from the last week, Mama. Right. And I have full of everything. Like, uh, 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 love it. That's always have to get the best. After all I'm Bomb. Hmm. I got one of macaroni. I want a potato. Mm -hmm. But that's what the fish. Yeah. But the little sauce in the fish with the potato, the pineapple, some of the grill. Take a bag of spine, and let the pine falls on the mushroom. Now, nah, everything got fit in the spoon, guys. Everything got fit. Right? See you there, guys. Mmm. This is my fish. the olives here and all. Pineapple. Potato. Mama. I, I know what to pick. Taste my first. Mama, I had the belly, you had the tail. I had the really flavor too. Yeah. I'm going to waste my first, eh? <laughs> we go fight. And the first cooked so far nice, it wasn't stiff nothing. Mm -hmm. I melt with them all. Alright guys, so this is it. You need to try this dish. It didn't cost much to do. We probably used about five pound of potatoes and all. The fish was like $50. The mashed potato was like probably $20 or so much. The cream cheese was 20 The cream cheese was, the cream cheese was the most expensive thing and the cheddar cheese. So I average, average around 50 to 20 cents. So we said $100. You get five, five foot long, five foot long roast fish. So you guys, if you know, if you go to the place regular where they sell any roast fish, I bet you would be close to that price for one or more than that for two. And I get five for this price. And really good. Feel, feel like, like we have still have a whole fish on the grill here. And everybody done it. And, every, and it was about seven of us eating Yeah, me, you, Petey. Mama, Papa. Mama, Papa, Chuchu, Ramesh. I said, Randall going home. So, guys, you can try this. It's the bomb. Okay. Until again, another edition. And this time we go in. Another, <laughs> another, another, <laughs> another, <laughs> another, <laughs> I can't even talk. <laughs> Hi guys.